to the gentleman who made that uh, critical post, my apologies, but you were 100% correct. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to Nick Clips. Today we are on location on a little 4th of July camping trip in Somerset, Wisconsin on the Apple River. And brought the camera gear with and wanted to go over the Condor Blue Cage and one of the other things that went along with this, the uh, swivel monitor mount. Now, overall with the cage itself, I'm super pleased with it. Um, it's turned out fantastic. It fits so securely to the camera. This top handle is awesome and it just looks badass, right? And we all know that's a very important thing. But what I wanted to focus on in this video is the swivel tilting monitor mount. And when I looked the reviews up on this on Amazon, it got some kind of shitty reviews. And um, the reason it got shitty reviews is one of these gentlemen was complaining about how there's two set screws here, two M4, not set screws, but two M4 screws that control the uh, compression and the uh, adjustment of the tilting aspect. So this, the ability for the monitor to tilt, let me zoom out a little bit here. So the ability of this monitor to tilt, uh, once you get where you'd like, you would then use an Allen wrench to, uh, you know, tighten these little guys down here. And when I read the reviews, I was like, oh man, that guy probably just didn't know what he was talking about. Well, to the gentleman who made that uh, critical post, my apologies, but you were 100% correct. So what I did was I replaced this little M4 socket head cap screw with uh, these M4 adjustable ones I found on Amazon. And I'll leave the link in the description. Now this is not just a straight up replacement because unfortunately these ones off Amazon the length of the stud is much longer than the set screw or the the normal saga head cap screw so i don't know if you can see that there but it's quite a difference so i bought one two pack and i just ground this down um so it'd be shorter i ground the first one down and it worked fine um the only thing though is that the diameter of the adjustable stud is just slightly bigger than the counterboard sort of custom um, bushing that they have on here. This anodized blue piece. It's actually cupped to allow the socket head cap screw to sit flush inside of there. And the diameter, the ID of this bore and the OD on the adjustable thing are almost the same. I took care of that, those two issues, with one very simple fix, and that is a fairly thick M4 washer. It's about three millimeters in thickness, and it has an OD that matches perfectly uh, with this uh, custom cupped bushing. And so it almost looks like it was meant to be that way. And so then, you don't have to shorten this at all. You just get this washer and this uh, adjustable screw thing from Amazon. And now you don't need a tool. And I can set how, this angle however I want it and then just lock it down quickly. And that is not going anywhere. So I found I only need to do it on the one side. Um, I don't need to have it on both sides, but that's a quick and simple fix to make this tilting and swivel monitor mount from Condor Blue to actually be useful and not frustrating. So if anyone else is looking to go down the same road, um, I would highly, highly suggest this modification. I think you can get two of these off Amazon for like eight bucks. And then these washers I got from McMaster Car, they were like a couple bucks. Uh, but maybe you could lucky, get lucky with these at your local hardware store. That's it. That's a quick one. 
like and subscribe peace out